Or Pugly. Okay, you're blinded by a sudden flash. It feels like giants are hammering on your temples and a monstrous pain lashes your chest. Your wound has responded at the worst possible moment and is gushing blood. You sense the malevolent proximity of the abyss. You can almost touch the threat emanating from it. Slowly, almost reluctantly, the wound closes. But the pain and your heightened awareness remain. Uh, the, the hail bears the uh, traces of the huge Balor's anger. Some demons are lying on the floor, literally, literally, literally ground into a bloody mess, while the rest are cowering against the walls. Monago, shivering, cowers, uh, covers the wound she's dealt. Monago, shivering, covers the wound you dealt her with one hand while trying with the other to wipe away the blood oozing from the symbol carved into her forehead. Let me into the rift, Tarasand. We're all going to die here. Trying to fight back. It's madness! No one goes into the rift. You will fight. All of you. Or else. If anyone will leave, let them go, demon. And fight me if you're so eager. I told you, Tarzant. Now you're going to die. And they'll hang your horned skull on the walls of Dresden. But what if we don't? You, you and your little troop made a fool of me at the Battle of Dresden. Finally, I can make you pay. Finally. Oh, Gimpy has false life. He should. Should have a charge left. Uh, let's see. Let's see if I put step this way. Ah. Okay, don't. Uh oh. He goes straight for Gimpy. Ember. Ember, back up. Um, 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 um. No fire ray. She starts just break right into the damage. Could try to turn him to a dog, but he'll resist that. Dun, dun, dun. This one he doesn't have to hit. She doesn't have to hit. She just puts that there. Could teleport the team away. Why would I want to do that? <laughs> Gimpy's going to go right behind the wall, probably. Man. Oh, do we give him bo his bow back? We did not. Endure this. No. Make every strike count. This. Cammy. 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 Oh, she's got the vines. Heal, that's not going to help us right now. True Sight, that doesn't help us against him. Lightning, that doesn't help at all. Dun -dun. That reduces uh, armor class. Of course, you need to save. Stanton. Stanton likes to summon demons. Okay. 
Arcane Bond to recover your resist energy spell. Oh, that's right. I forget about that stuff. I never even think about that kind of thing. Oh, the skeleton is not healthy. Get closer, please. Oh, look, he's burning. Or she's burning. Okay, Gimpy. Get away from him. Um, Mastodon? Fallen? Other stuff? Swarms? Oh, the acid. Because we're resistant to acid, aren't we? Yes, we are. They're resistant to acid, aren't they? Because, you know, demons. Let's try this way. She's in the fire. Oh, ten points of acid. Damn it. Come on, you told me that part. You guys didn't tell me that part. Dead. Flick serious ones. That works on them. Destruction works too. Hmm, but spell resistance. You can down. You get a shadow demon out of that too. Going after Staunton. Staunton got his ass kicked in the last fight, too, if I remember right. So, Ember. Step away. Well, I'm gonna go with her. Probably can't sleep him. So. Evil eye. Uh, it'll probably, yeah, he, we can curse him, but the chance he's going to resist it more than likely. You've crossed the wrong Come on, road. you pansy. Get back in there and fight. His AC is 59. So, see, the evil eye is right there. Step into the acid. Because why not? Yeah, I know. I know you can understand by cackling, but I think she's too far away now.
starting. Um, another demon. Heal yourself. It's chat that does the same thing as Cackle. Oh, yeah, I don't think she has that. ACs, welcome to this channel. Got the spell or something cast on? No. I don't have a whole lot of success with the spelling stuff. Spider swarms though. Ones, but that's eh. no spell resistance for Gimpy. What do you think with the twelve plus your cast level? I don't know what Gimpy's. Gimpy's got spell resistance, but I'm not sure. I think he does. Spell resistance 29. So would that stack? Does the spell stack with this? It shouldn't. Okay. I'll take that. Back. Ooh, an acid pit. Think you'll fall in? Oh, he's too big, isn't he? Is he too big to fall in an acid pit? Any large or smaller creature standing in the area where you go into the pit must make a reflex shape. He's got to be bigger than large. Can I fear him? This will hurt. Death probes it is. 33 spell resistance, will 25, he's probably gonna make the save. Dominate person, so he's probably gonna be resistant to fear. Try to dispel some magic. It's not going to work, but. I winning? Never winning, Cat. Never winning. Say this is my luck. Oh, got bark skin. Woohoo! Oh, look, we can do it again because Gimpy's got magic. The magic touch. Oh, so we dispelled the acid fog from him. That's wonderful. See, this is why we don't do the spell. It just doesn't seem to work very well. I mean, we get the stuff that we really don't care about. Let's 
it should uh, worry him. You want to tuck? Ow. Stop's gonna have to heal himself, maybe? Okay, Amber. Just for fun. And last him with Hellfire. And she missed. Because she rolled a two. And she only had to roll a. I don't know. Seven. Ah. <laughs> uh. Survive me. Aren't your legs getting stiff? Nope. You haven't moved in quite a while. Stretch, damn it, you ignorant meatbag. I was like, no, I'm going the wrong direction. I'm supposed to be using the, the spell, the fire resistance, the upgraded one, but. Do that now, it's too far away from Gimpy. See? Game hates me. Okay, Staunton, you have a. He can't heal himself because he doesn't have access to the spell anymore because of the stupid corruption stuff. Nobody has this. Spell area. See? <laughs> fail, 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 fail. Yep, you got a dispel in there, I think. Did he? Fail, fail, fail. Spills acid fog from the spider swamp, so. See, again, dispel magic is not my friend. Check a potion. Oh, he's got a scroll back, but he's already done something, right? Guns off. No guns off here. Guns off. <laughs> I can't. Do it. Okay, I might save one another another round there. Need more uh, shadow. Demons. Awesome dice roll, by the way. Go Shadows. See, they're doing their job. Ow. So the swarms are taking damage from the acid. That's okay. Touch, you gotta get close. Don't want that. Oh, these should work on him. Except for the spell resistance thing. Okay. 
help our little undead friends over there. Getting Gimpy in position to hide around behind the wall when he's ready to die. Oh, a lot of ones. Oh, there's a 20. Oh, look at the misses. Okay. So, Ember. I'm just having the archer circle around because I got nothing Enjoy better to do. This. Oh, and Stunt didn't take damage that time, so that gives him free time to uh, summon another demon. Yeah, we... Let's reduce his chance to hit. Because everybody needs 20s to hit him anyway. Shadow Demon, so it's fine. I guess we should keep reducing the armor. Because the Shadow Demons actually have a chance of hitting them. Just like that. Oh, that's right. The Queen is here. She's here to help out, along with her little friend. So, we're gonna play chicken. And... Make sure this is turned on. So that skeletons probably can't take damage from the acid, that's okay. So the, the wall does block his sight. Okay, that's fine. Oh, you know, I just remember she doesn't want to get farther. Away. She doesn't want to get far from Gimpy. She wants to be close because he's giving her buffs. Shit. See, last time they showed up, they, the fight was basically over. But now, actually, is mostly over now too. Oops. Please stop saying oops. You are making me look bad. <laughs> so much for not hitting friendlies. <laughs> That's okay. They'll be fine. I'm sure they'll just. They'll be fine. Honestly, they'll be fine. Uh. <laughs> Make every strike count. Right, this is an R diva, that's their diva. Reduce his armor class. It's 
starting. Summon another demon for fun. Ah, oh, he's not doing any damage. Bad rolls. Yeah, I think he's outside of Gimpy's range to be affected, I think. Wait a minute, that's not that far. He should be in range. Hmm. Hey, Serenus, welcome back. Oh, this is typical for me. Zimbra's Curse of Vulnerability work at all and a successful will save. Curse of Vulnerability work at all? I don't know. I haven't read the details on that one. Oops. Please Galfrey, stop saying oops. We didn't mean to hurt you. You are making me look bad. Yeah, it, I know that's I know it's what it does, but I've never actually had it work. <laughs> so we've got that problem. They always make their saves. It's it's a it's very stupid. Anyone that you actually want to use it on, they always make the save. So, we're hurting our little skeletons with the acid cloud, but that's okay. when it, she lands it before your swarms go. Yeah. Hey, we're down to 18. He overcame the spell resistance of the diva, but the diva made it saving throw. Okay, Amber. A successful save reduces it to just one round. Ah, okay. Well, maybe we should use that then. Hey, Dan, welcome back. So he made his save. That should make it last two rounds, right? I guess we should... It doesn't? Well, it doesn't matter. She didn't have anything else to do. You've crossed the wrong mongrel! Some conditions, foresight... And AC. There's a vulnerability curse. It's lasting for five seconds, so that's a round. What you need to do is read bad poetry to him. We'll do lots, lots of litter uh, damage to him. Shh. Survive me. Go land. <laughs> I 
Rocket's upset because Mrs. Gimpy's been gone too long. So the energy thing. We don't even know how much it actually does, do we? It's energy resistance is still there. I wonder, like I said, I don't even know what it does. Because it doesn't, it's, it's not affecting his energy resistances here on this screen or that info page. So I don't even know what it actually does. But, you know, the armor class stuff works. Can't put lots of time in. Well, yeah, these types of games are definitely a huge time investment. Like, I'm up over 150 hours on this playthrough alone. And it's my first one. And I have, I'm not, accordingly to other people, I'm maybe halfway. Oops, shit. Wrong button. Oh, shadow demons. Suppresses some of his energy resistance because shadow demons do cold damage. Oh. Oh, they've been they've been doing little bits of damage here and there. I mean, now it's more that's a little bit reduced, but they're definitely doing more damage than they were. Poor little skeletons, gonna die to the acid. I figured that's what they were doing, because they seem to hit most things. Those are skeletons. <laughs> okay, our fallen's up there now. Still have three swarms up and a skeleton. I shouldn't have used the acid thing, it doesn't seem to be helping at all. Try doing fine trap them. That's probably not going to work. Watch, keep he's gonna die. He has to overcome. <sighs> don't kill him, please. Don't kill him, please. Please don't kill him. He, I think he does have it, Ring. I think he does have it. Here we go. This is not my time. Got Gippy again, because I was stupid. Oh, maybe not. Are usually chaotic and unstable. That's why I've been plagued by one question. How could demons have created a stable Oof. permanent passage from the abyss here in the world wound? And as I stare into the flames of the rift itself, the answer still eludes me. What is the secret to this canker festering at the very heart of our world? How can we heal it? My friends and comrades. The time has come for us to discuss something of the utmost importance. It is here, on the threshold of the Abyss, 
that I must announce an important decision before you all. But first, we shall talk about you, Commander. About how well you have discharged the duties I entrusted to you. Uh oh. Oh, let's see. Veronica is going to be saying, "Take a break here any second now." Hopefully, we get this. My righteous sister in faith, must these discussions take place now at such a moment? The enemy is watchful, and its forces are great. That is what we must turn our attention to, not scrutinizing our fellow crusaders. In the hundred years that this war has lasted, not a day has gone by when I haven't thought about how we can win it. That is precisely why we cannot delay the conversation any longer. Lawful, you have my full attention, Hello, my Gimpy. queen. Here we go. It's time to take a break. Go get some more water while you are up. After we're done with this part. Your next break is in two hours. My full attention. Your forbearance is most appreciated. She's got a thing for Gimpy. I don't know if anybody knows that the yet. The first and most glaring issue I'd like to discuss is how you have used the divine gift that was bestowed upon you. Uh-oh. An aura of necromancy uh -oh. hangs over Dresden. My clerics and paladins tell me they have never seen anything like it. <laughs> Even Geb. And its source is quite obvious. It's not me. I'm not a lich. However, as your friend... I must confess that your mythic powers are too unstable. I cannot fully trust them. I fear they will stand in the way of our friendship. <gasps> A commander's absolute priority is leading the Crusader armies. And I cannot help but notice that you have handled this part of your responsibilities well. Duh. I cannot but notice your strange choice of companions. The good gods teach us to seek the light even in the darkest soul, and to believe in redemption. But it is one thing to believe in the good intentions of a murderous succubus, and, for example, send her to a temple of Desna to be cared for by experienced priests. <laughs> but it is another matter entirely to take the demon with you to the front lines, where one well-timed stab in the back could put a tragic end to our entire crusader cause. It is unthinkably reckless with all due respect my lady Arushale has proven herself to be a faithful and reliable comrade she has fought bravely for us and we both want to see the demons defeated is there any reason to reproach the commander for accepting her into our party you can find reasons aplenty in any Mendevian cemetery Sila. each one is full of the graves of those who were deceived by demons uh, we're not the angel. Diplomacy. Intimidate. Uh oh. That you were the one who assigned uh, Nora Deva to my entourage, who turned out to be an Baphomet cultist. So, which is uh, just my capable of choosing where the companions. Uh oh. Who only had to roll a four on that one. That's an automatic, and this fails. Trust her completely. She's not only a, good, a loyal friend, but living proof that even demons can change for the better. We'll go that route. Your words I don't trust my dice sense. rolls to beat a four. The example of one malfactor changed for the better could do more for the Crusades than a dozen paragons of faith. Thank you. I can't believe you really said that. You ignored the signal of the horn, telling you to return to the Fane's entrance and help our allies with the defense. What? This was both an ethical and a tactical failure. What horn? I also wish to mention what you did with Iomade's banner, the Sword of Valor. This sacred relic handed to you to defend the city against the demons has become a reflection of you. I do not know how you managed to distort its features, but I cannot overlook it. I didn't do I anything. I pray that Iomade will forgive us all for this most improper treatment of her relic. Wow, she's putting a lot of blame on me for something I didn't do. That is all I wish to say. And now, to summarize. Oh, God. You can think my assessment is empty fault-finding, but I am responsible for the entire crusade. For Mendev. And for the future of those who have encountered or will encounter the evil of the world wound, I do not have the luxury of making a single mistake. 
Yeah, that's whatever. That is why I am forced to remove you from the command of the fifth state. <gasps> what? So this is what you were hinting at at our conversation on the wall. You were trying to say that you, our duty demanded that you strip me of my command, and of course, that is a this was contrary to your own wishes. You granted me this title, and you have the right to take it away. This is how you thank me for everything I've done. I won't stand for this. Ugh. Go with number one. Contrary to my wishes. She whispers, oh no. Grab me the title and you have the right to take it away. Darren. Eh, throughout this clean spe entire speech, Darren is silent, but his silence is more expressive than an entire crowd yelling profanities. This is why I always take payment up front. The customers become very shifty when everything is done. I deeply respect the desire to bring discipline to the Crusades, but not all the accusations you leveled at the Commander are guided by that desire. My righteous sister, you are entitled to make such a decision, but please reconsider whether this is the right one. He is not just the Crusade Commander. He is our hope, our only hope. I wish you'd not listen to this guy. Is he? I see you do not value me or the other heroes of the crusade very highly, my righteous brother and comrade. Duel. But let me continue. Do not take your demotion as a punishment. I have in many respects been forced to take this step. As we all know, the demons have created a new weapon, Nehindrian crystals, which provide them with truly mythical powers. We managed to remove the threat temporarily, but not eliminate its source. Thanks to the book recovered from a really Vorlish's laboratory, we know that the rift before us cannot be closed until the first and main rift is closed. The one that lies in the Threshold Fortress. So, for the safety of Dresden, I shall have to destroy all the exits out of the Midnight Fane and block everything here so that demons coming through this indestructible rift cannot descend upon Dresden again. This is a forced measure. I am doing it for the safety of the city. But this won't solve the problem. We should... No, we must track the demon's path and settle this issue once and for all. And that means venturing into the abyss. No one but you with your unique power, can handle this task. That is why I shall take over the command of the Crusader army. Of course. And you will journey forth on this great mission. How oh, if I refuse? If you destroy the Fane in its exit, how I return? Don't worry about that. I will go with you, and I know the secrets of traveling between planes. I have also been to the Abyss before, and I have fought the beasts that dwell there. My sword and my experience will help you on this mission. Can I turn him to undead? <laughs> I want him to be undead. Uh, what if I refuse? It will mean that one day the abyss will come for you. I might disagree with my righteous sister in arms at times, but there is one thing she is indisputably right about. Evil must be killed at the root. The Nehindrian crystals are too great a threat, and we may never get another chance of reaching their source. Correct. I imagine I'll be up to the task of leading the Crusaders. A hundred odd years of experience must count for something, but your mission in the Abyss is critical. I'll go to the Abyss, but don't think I won't forget the way you treated me. She had brows furrow, but she refrained from comment. Valor, bravery, and loyal comrades. We have all this in abundance. With it, even the Abyss holds no fear for us. Wish me luck as well. Until next we meet. <laughs> because he's far enough away, he's the only one who didn't take any damage from that stupid demon exploding. 
Wait for the fog to go away. It should be going away not too much longer. Anyway, I need to take a break. I'm about uh, 10 minutes late or so because of all that stuff. But uh, 